Okay, this is a quick tutorial on how to add audio to your assets. Uh, currently, your supports um, audio. Uh, your, you can have one audio um, clip uh, per asset, and you can have it either start right away or um, when you use the play option in ear. I highly recommend uh, not having it start right away because that means as soon as you click it, on in the library before you even place it down it'll start playing your audio which in most cases you probably don't want but that's up to you so anyways here we are in unity i've got already my fire elemental uh, here set up uh, you make your asset uh, just like you would normally make an asset that doesn't have audio and then we just add the audio so again i've got my asset here um, i'm going to go to the inspector here add component and type audio source audio source okay i've added now a audio source to my uh, <clears throat> asset uh, here is where we've got the play on wake um, i don't want the audio to play um, automatically um, i'm guessing that my players might get annoyed with the audio playing all of the time especially if multiple assets have different audio. So I am going to turn this off. And that way, uh, when you want to actually play the audio, you trigger that in your uh, extra asset uh, registration plugin, and it'll play uh, your audio clip. Okay, so we've added our, uh, our audio source. Uh, now I'm going to make a folder here for audio. Uh, you don't really need to. It's it's not necessary to make a separate folder for that. I like to do that to keep things nicely organized. And now I'm going to import asset. Downloads. Okay, I download. So this is just a WAV file. Um, I've tried WAV files, I've tried MP3 files. Uh, Unity probably supports other files too, but um, those are the ones I've tried. So I've now imported the WAV file. I'm going to go back to uh, my asset. There's the audio source. And it's just a matter of dragging and dropping it to audio clip. And that's basically it. Now, if you build the asset, it will have um, this um, audio attached to it, and you can trigger it in ear um, to uh, play and stop. Um, just in case, I usually go and actually mark that um, folder as being part of the um, asset. Theoretically, you don't need to do that. Unity is supposed to figure out what components um, go into the package or are necessary for the package, but I prefer to do that just in case. Yeah, so once you've got that, you would just go through your normal process of build asset bundle, and that's it. Really simple to add audio to your mini. And that's about it.